I have not talked to you guys in so long. All I did was post a YouTube video of me crying, and then I like ghosted your ass again. It's like crazy. I ghost everyone these days, but I'm officially moved into my apartment. I bought a microphone. I have like studio lights. Like who the fuck am I? I first want to start off by saying that I do not have those ugly fucking things on my window. I do now have curtains, and I just wanted to clarify that. But I thought now was the right time to tell you all that I'm going to a music festival. And I was like, let me bring you in on the journey. I'm going to Las Vegas. We're all going to Life is Beautiful for my friend Leo's birthday. It's going to be really fun. I haven't even thought about it once, honestly. I don't even have an outfit. But yeah, it's going to be me, Sarah, Leia, and Matt. Christelle can't go anymore. That is my life update right now. See you when I can see you. So Sarah and I made it a promise to each other on the way to vegas i'm not even getting i think we even like held each other's fucking pinkies and i looked her in the eyes and i was like we need to set an intention for this fucking trip and she looked at me and we we're like our goal is just to be present so then when my phone was fucking stolen can we be grateful can we be grateful we're alive so tired i know you're so alive you're thriving I think. Like, yes, I got in a sketchy situation, and she literally wanted to suck my d Hey, Brian. Yeah. Come here. I know I'm being. I just, like, don't want to eat of us to get too drunk or, like, I want me and you to kind of, like, hold each other accountable tonight. If I'm, like, running away from you guys. I know we do that, but it's just, like, not what we do at, like, a festival type of. No, I get that. Especially like, here. It's just, like, I just unsafe. Worried, I don't know. Worried about what? Yourself? No, like... Me having the most fun is me being free and roaming around and I don't want to do that. And also I know how you get when you're blacked out drunk. Kidnapped. <laughs> Kidnapped and then everyone gets worried about you. So like, I just don't want anyone to worry. We just need to stick together. Totally. And can you promise me that? I mean, yeah. I'm gonna fucking grow up. Oh my god, I need to go outside. Wait, I'm not being mad at you. Ew, can you please call someone? Like, I'm like genuinely like so grossed out. I have some bad news. Hi. The Airbnb is trash. It's disgusting. It's trash? Yeah, like no one cleaned it. Those sheets are disgusting. There's trash everywhere. Yeah. You guys, we are in a pickle. <laughs> like, I'm not trying to be dramatic. Because, like, I'm grateful to be here. Like, <sighs> this is, like, a privilege to even be here. But, like, y'all. Love to see it, you guys. Airbnb loves it. I don't know what it is about walking into a hotel room and just like knowing that someone's been in here recently. Dude, there's like a shit in the toilet. <laughs> Get that fucking food out of here. Towels, like gross, ew! Who has sex on this bed? I think it's time for a drink. Can you get that pizza out of my sight? First, we need our luggage. That's oh step one. Who yeah. did we call? Um, this number. Light on. Okay, I actually off. <laughs> oh, it's so dusty. It's so, like, gross. It's like my chlamydia. The carpets are like stained as fuck. Someone had a good night. Dude, ew! Yeah, we walked in filming, all excited. The sheets are used, there's trash in it. Food everywhere. We got trash, trash, the bed. Thank you for calling the concierge. Literally, who was fucking in here? Truthfully, I don't really care. Please continue to hold. This is calling for a refund. Thank you for calling the concierge. Okay, this isn't working for me. Hi, Michelle. Um. Is this where I call for the bellman? Yeah. Oh, okay, perfect. And then I have another question. Yeah. This is an Airbnb rental, but the room is like trashed. Is that like the Airbnb's job or is it the hotel? They have a separate house. 
housekeeping company than us. Mm. You just reach out to your host, they should be able to send up their housekeeping company, okay? Okay, thank you so much. Of course. Have a good rest of your day. Thank you as well. Bye. I loved her. There's nothing holding me back. Because there is nothing holding me back from this shot. I have to pee, but I don't want to go to the bathroom. Oh, I got a shit. Oh. Pretty freaking bad. I don't know, Dr. Ryan. It's like you expect one thing. And then life just comes at you quick, you know? Totally. You just like expect the best, but somehow always get the worst. Time and time again. You know, I just wanted to have a chill weekend with my friends. See Tame and Paula tonight, you know? Right. Get a little litty off that tequila. <laughs> I thought this was my session. Are you even listening to me? Do you even care? What am I paying you for? Nothing. I'm just pretty fucking creeped out, freaked mm -hmm. out, stressed out, stressed. Right, I got that. I liked it. <laughs> With a little accent. Thanks. Stressed. Stressed. I'm a little stressed. Therese. Teresa. I just wanted to walk into a clean space take my shoes off, but now I can't do that. There's poop on the ground. Sperm. Um. But then at the same time, I'm blessed. We did a gratitude meditation last night. So I'm grateful to even be here, mm -hmm. doctor. But then there's a part of me where it's like, no one deserves this. It's shot time. <laughs> now that I got that out. I oh, know, I loved it. <laughs> I really needed that actually, that helped. Actually though, like I'm like, okay, let's party now. We can take shots out of these. All right. This is why my mom said she was scared of me when I get drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of love this angle. Ew, and you know what's been going on in those bedrooms. Oh, we know. The sheets are messy and I had like, oh. I had a gag attack, like I couldn't stop gagging. Gagging here, honey. Okay, you guys have to go back immediately. Like, you've got to get out of there. Hi. Hey. The party's already been here. Yeah, fucking apparently. It happened last night without us. Hey, girly. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. Your nail. Oh my god. Open it. It's literally. Oh. Those are really tight. Do you want to get on the therapist's yeah, couch? Really nice oh, yeah, I had a therapy this session. The <laughs> right. I was like, wow. Was like, now we have a name. What's her name? Pill bottle. Sandra. We know a fucking Sandra. <laughs> we found her pill bottle in the trash can. Sandra. We should look it up. We should. Let's find her on Facebook and let's tell her how we feel. <laughs> Yeah, this is popping. I love that. That speaker sucks. Hey, you guys. It is me, Ryan P. We are currently in the glitter station. I was not planning on wearing this tonight. Well, actually, at all. Apparently, they want me to look like House Bunny. I love that movie. Next! I love Anna Ferris. I think she's hilarious. What do you guys think? Everybody comment how hot Ryan is. Why are you doing that? Wow. Wow. Well, wait, no, keep doing that pose. It looks like a pop star. Whoa! This painting, you guys. You got these bits. You wanna know where they're from? I don't remember. I've never worn a vest in my life. I'm just not a vest girl. I feel like a waiter, like a butler. He did have a nipple tassel, and if I had one of those, I think it'd be hot. It's my birthday. Were they wet? 
You smoked what out of the they porta potty? Were, we smoked joint. It was the urinal doobie. Wait, Cause what? I just always pee like this and it just like, they fell. Do in. you pee on them too? Yeah. yeah. Oh. yeah. How do you right. dig in it? Like how? I just went. It's so far down. Dude, I, no, 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 wait. Not a porta potty, a urinal. Oh, okay. I just grabbed them and pee. Uh, and so we dried them off and we smoked them. I love it. Look, this is a seal. I see it, kinda. You know, it's always better when you like do it from like up top. That sounds like a trigger. I love my right sense. Let's do this. How do I? This is just a video. Oh, it's already on. Yeah, this is a video. It's, like we're it's not even taking a photo. But we're like we're live. No, no, this isn't hooked up to Instagram. This is just a camera. <laughs> so these are fun. Wait, where's? Hey! Yeah. Sunday. Here we go. Get your mask. Cheers, brother. Should we take another Too shot? Soon. Wait, we have to go. Okay, sure. let's go. Yeah. Shot and go. <laughs> Wait, where's my ugly little vest? Ryan. What? Two minutes now. Two minutes, you guys. Fuck, I shouldn't have called Where the vest? No, no, no. We're good. We're good. No, you're fine. Power let's just three? breathe. I don't need underwear. You don't. I don't I'm not wearing any. <laughs> you really don't. I wish I filmed that because I was the best. I, <laughs> I was the best. Yeah. It looked like she was walking from yeah. the side. Yeah. I was like, I don't need, need underwear. Okay, I'm gonna take one away. shot, you guys. Ryan, hurry the fuck up now. I'll put on my vest, Marie. Oh, fuck up. No. I knew I shouldn't have called it. I knew I shouldn't. No, have. we're good. Worst comes to worst. Guess what? You get a five dollar cancellation fee, and then you say, Oh, my hurry Uber never came. Up. What are you doing? I know, just like, let's stop stressing you guys. Ryan, relax, hurry the fuck up. Bitch, I just no. have to put a vest on. I'm stop ready. Stop talking, hurry up, take the shot, put the Ooh. vest on. What are you wait What are you waiting for? Let's stop the target attack. This isn't ISIS. Ryan, hurry the fuck this up. This is ISIS. I'm this taking a so shot. Annoying. you're just doing nothing. Shh. I'm taking a shot. Oh my God, he's literally two minutes away. You need to hurry the fuck up. This was expensive. That was one second. I love that. You wasted about 15 I think the distraction is the argument. Put on the shirt, let's go. I'm aware. Get your mask. I am aware. I love that this is still recording. It's the best. No, are you serious? No, no, this is okay. real time, you guys. They're gonna think I'm such a bitch. No, it's just, that is life. It is life. It says Joe. I'm wearing Joe. Jolene. Jolene. Little life update. I tragically hobbled in to the hotel room last night, or I guess this morning at 7 a.m. He called me at five and was like, Leia, help me, I'm at the MGM. On his FaceTime, in the background, it was Fremont Hotel, which is in downtown Las Vegas. But he swore he was at our he hotel He was like, I'm at, at the, the MGM, MGM. I was like, no, you're <laughs> fucking not, you psychopath. Which he was not. You so I ditched know. the whole group, I loved it. I've been sleeping for three hours, and Ryan walks in, bangs down the door, well, not really, like but he knocks, he knocks, he knocks, <laughs> The whole door down. <laughs> I answered the Just door. Blow it off. He's like, I'm gonna tell you about my whole night, and I said, Shut the fuck up. We're going to bed. True story. I swear I had my phone. So there is a possibility it's in this trash of a room. I remember cracking it so much for my case to fight case. And then Want someone Taco Bell. Some girl Left his phone literally in her car. thought I looked so hot. Apparently that she literally wanted to suck my. <laughs> She took me in her car because my phone was dead. Like I was you so went in fucked. Hoping to get your d sucked. <laughs> totally, I was so uncomfortable because I'm like I'm gay. And she's like, 
but have you ever tried? And I was like, this just like isn't the vibe, Queen. She tried to hustle me and took me to an ATM and wanted me to pay her $100. Her friend hopped in the car and then I literally think I left my phone in there. So now I have no phone. If they had let me vent my probably would have used my phone, but it was dead. So, regardless, so useless. I don't know what my plan was. The whole group went back to the hotel room and I was like, I'm gonna go out. I like literally don't know what my end game was. I literally am useless. I lost so much footage from yesterday. That's what I'm most upset about. Cause I have insurance. Like it's not a big deal about the phone, but I'm really upset. And I lost those fucking glasses. Those amazing glasses. It's Leia's birthday. Let's look at her fit. The outfit is custom. It's like a Ed Hardy shirt reworked. Okay. It's from Shea Kawaii. And then the shoes are knockwall. They're the knockoff. Naked Wolf shoes. Loves that. So I didn't spend $300 on the shoes. However, I did spend that much on the outfit. It's Leia's 25th motherfucking birthday. Ew. Woo! Don't remind me. You're halfway, halfway to 50, 50, baby! That's hot. You keep following me as I'm trying to exit the frame. How do you feel? <laughs> hot. I do feel hot. Do you look hot. Thank you. You also look hot, Matt. Thanks. I love mm -hmm. this little tiara. Isn't it good, though? Yeah, I love it. It's great. I love it too. <laughs> Toodles, that's my update. That's what you missed on the Disney that's... Channel. Yep. Do you want to show off the deal? No. Okay. Well, you look amazing from the reflection that I can see. Thank you. Sir, I'm a boy. Stop! He's really hot. So, you guys, we got an exciting motherfucking update. This vlog is so anticlimactic because I lost my entire phone. Oh, Christelle's here! Oh, hey! Ah, hi. I made it. How was your drive? It was really ugly, but it was fun. Do you want to spill the drama? So I bought my ticket off of my friend. She lives in New York, and she shipped it to me one day shipping, but she sent it out on Wednesday, and then it didn't get here until this morning. I miss Team Impala, so I'm pissed, but I will be vibing regardless. And I was trying to sell this ticket, couldn't sell it. At least she's here. Woo! She's here! I'm here. Twerk again? Uh, yeah. Bye everyone. Uh, I have an interactive game for you all. Find the join on my body. Okay. And just, you know, be like, you look at the whole fit. Okay. All right. You have five seconds. You guys, me as a viewer, I'm like, okay, ear. Nothing there. Nothing there. Other ear. Way. I feel nothing in the ears. There's nothing in the ears. But there is something hidden. There is. Beautiful bands. But she has laid ear. If you were to just look at me, you wouldn't be like, that's a joint. That's a joint in your hair. No, no, She's but right. now it's... a bump it. I love that. She's so cool. Shit, shit, shit. She's like call. a stoner girly. Guys, our, I wish I could smoke is weed. Here and he's like, on horse. I am 
negative 42 hours of sleep. Woo! <laughs> but I'm laying on the ground in Las Vegas, which is the most disgusting place for me to lay down in my life. I right, think you're stunned. Hi, you guys, it's me, Ryan P. Oh, literally. It's like a fucking Christmas tree. Just... I wanted to just leave our hotel room so I can go downstairs and get a drink because I was sad about a boy. And guess what? Mwah. Why are we here? I think we're having fun. At eight in the morning and I'm negative 42 hours of sleep, God damn it! Can we be grateful? Can we be grateful? We're alive. I'm so tired. <laughs> I know. You're so alive. You're thriving. I think. Alive and I am not so you might as well just die. I, we met this really amazing hot man. He was horrible. <laughs> I had to sit there and listen to this man talk to you for an hour. And he was misogynistic. <laughs> he was racist as fuck. Homophobic. He was so homophobic. And I had to sit there and you were entertaining it. He bought us alcohol. So I said, why not? And then I was like, you know what? It's 7 a.m. Why are we taking shots? I'm so mad. Why are we taking shots? So are you actually mad? No. Why is it sunny outside? <laughs> I've never been this annoyed because the love of my life hates me. Me? No. You're welcome. <laughs> I, I need a fucking hotel room. Let's go back to the hotel. No! I am not sleeping in a room. <laughs> what are we doing, Mike? I'm getting a hotel six, bitch. I'm just trying to get like... Okay, I'm out of the way, buddy. I am getting a hotel six. I don't care. I don't care. I'm so tired. I am not going back into that hotel room. Eventually. Uh, uh, get out of the stream. Okay. Uh, get out of the stream. Get out of the Eventually. It's 807. I love that. Uh, Hello, you guys. I'm gonna hobble over. Ryan, Hi. what are you drinking right now? A fucking white claw. Show me. I have not gone to bed. I don't plan to, you guys. Tonight is the night. It's fucking nine in the morning. <laughs> what are you doing <laughs> drinking a white claw at nine in the morning? It's fucking body. I love it. <laughs> it is day two. This is it day two? I haven't slept. I don't plan on it. I'm going to do some errands for the crowd. There's some bitches over here. I'm running their errands. We're doing dry cleaning today. We gotta get a room key and we gotta get a con. <gasps> They're gonna try to. F Can you not? <laughs> it's gonna be really odd. Wait, how do I ask for a con <gasps> without it being weird? Yeah. Toodle Lou. Here we go. What the hell? What is up with you in this fucking velvet hat? We can buy it at TJ Maxx for $4. But it's special. I'm special. I love me Harry Styles. Do you think they love me on Harry Styles? What is up with you in that fella ass hat? Because I don't trust you. Well, what do you think is going to happen? Can you hold this? <gasps> what happened? He just spilled She just dumped my drink on me. What's that about? I'm out of here. No, <laughs> yeah, I can't to cover my hair. I look like a leprechaun. You never see me. You'll never forget me. Can you guys, do you guys have a con? <gasps> Are you blogging? No, I'm not. Hey guys. Doing that tonight. It's not the vibe. You all gonna think it's for me. Like I'm like the fucking hotel stripper. This is Vegas. I don't think they're gonna. From floor 307, bitch. I mean. It's yours. Oh, I thought this was a fucking popper. I was like, really, like, okay, I'm like, I wish. Oh, I love it, you guys. I love it. We are living. I'm gonna love it. Hey, 
What am I getting? A con and hotel keys? Yes. Okay. For room 7-Eleven. Take a... Oh, you don't have a phone. 32 7-Eleven. 32 7-Eleven. 32 7-Eleven. Oh my god. Yes. This is day three, you guys. We got the hair tinsel. Yeah, look at this shit. The makeup, the butterfly clips. Totally Kelly, right? Cadet Kelly, bitch. Um, you guys haven't seen Christy Carlson or Mama? I think I'm gonna faint. I'm not kidding. I feel not in my body. I feel like sleep deprived. Oh, because you didn't sleep. We walked three miles, five. We worked out. I'm so tired. I'm not gonna vlog right now. I love them like talking to this, like as if like I'm talking to someone, but I just can't do this right now. So you guys, we are watching. Uh... So long story short, I'm sitting in my fucking closet with like a makeshift microphone stand. It's really the lamest I've ever felt in my entire life. I'm honestly, oh, I forgot to fucking click record. Why am I sitting on the closet floor next to Rainy Rodriguez? But I lost my phone and I literally never had a better time. So for some context, Sarah and I went down a day early and we stayed at this Hotel Paris because we were like, we could either leave early or get there the day of the festival, which sounds like a fucking nightmare to drive five hours and check into the hotel, then go to a festival. Sounds like a mission. Got there at like 4 a.m. We were already sleep deprived the following day. I don't even want to deal with like filming myself right now. I just am not in the mood. Anyways, so Sarah and I made a promise to each other on the way to Vegas. I'm not even kidding. I think we even like held each other's fucking pinkies. And I looked her in the eyes and I was like, we need to set an intention for this fucking trip. And she looked at me and we we're like, our goal is just to be present. So then when my phone was fucking stolen, I was like, I can either let this ruin the trip or I can just have a good time. And I chose the latter. It was probably easier because we were in fucking Vegas. So it's like, whatever. But I got to actually experience the festival super, super present. It was very interesting. And we didn't even do any DRU drumsticks. I felt like a sober motherfucking queen. I mean, I did get pretty drunk, which is fine. I'm in Vegas. What else are you going to do? So I decided to go out till 9 a.m., every day never wanted to go back to the room because like what else would i do you know like people are just gonna go on instagram mm, couldn't be me i'm gonna go hit the fucking casino bring sarah along this time and we're gonna like just talk all night it was the best time we were just vibing in like the bar on the downstairs and then the next thing you know you just walk outside and it's fucking 8 a.m i was like this is fun okay that's all that matters and i was having a blast having a giggle and I loved it so much that I literally got a cellular watch just so that I can like purposely get away from my phone. Like it was just so fucking freeing. And I felt so lost and like weird the past two months because of like everything. Moving, losing my friend, RIP. He's not dead, but he's fine. <laughs> I think, I hope he's at a festival so he could lose his phone. But I don't know where I was going with that. I don't know what I'm doing. But Leia, just to clarify, she is the mom of the group. Like, yes, I got in a sketchy situation and she literally wanted to suck my dick. Whatever. <laughs> it's like, it happens. I get it. I'm really hot. Um, But no, Leia is the mom of the group. She's trying to keep me under wraps. Yes, we argue, but she's not a bitch. So before anyone says that, just wanted to clarify. Um, Yeah, that is, I think, everything I have to clarify. I miss you all. And I definitely will be posting more now that I have curtains and this fucking video that took forever to edit is done. So I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope this podcast part, what is going on, doesn't come out sounding so horrible. But that is the story. Bye.